Hey, Snack Pack. This is my new friend, Kathy. Hey. Kathy, can you tell uh, the Snack Pack a little about yourself? And today we're going to show your van, Velma. All right, cool. Um, yeah, my name is Kathy uh, Rivers, and I am a flight attendant. I'm 55 years old, and I've been a van lifer for a year now. Awesome. We met in the parking lot of Walmart. We did. And we just instantly connected. And we just did an interview, so watch that video if you haven't. But today is all about showing off the awesome minivan. That's oh, right. what, what type of van is it? What year? Uh, 2014 Toyota Sienna. Okay, awesome. And let's see what you got in it. All right. I actually have three blankets. I have a, a mattress pad and a sheet. I got like these Sherpa type uh, blankets. I find that they're um, a lot better. I do have a comforter, but it's too bulky. You know what I mean? Um, so I like the blankets better. And then this is a ottoman that turns into a chair, that turns into a chase, that turns into a bed. Ooh. So, yeah, so when I do my like deep clean, I do like a deep clean, like maybe every month, every three weeks to four weeks, I can just take everything out and fold up the chair and take it out. So, you know, it's, it's really good. This is the ottoman. And then you see the legs. This is the legs that come out. So it like all folds up, you know, wow. I did have to put it on a, a board because, you know, the Toyota Sienna kind of the, the floors aren't level. Yeah. So I had to kind of raise it and I'm not a carpenter, so I can't, you know, I don't want to put a floor in there. So I did what I had to. It has like about this uh, big of a padding on it. And then I have a four inch memory foam uh, padding on top of that. So that was, I got it off of Amazon and it actually fits. I took my second row seats out, but it actually fits with my second row seats in. So anybody who, you know, because I originally I didn't want to take my second row seats out, but I ended up taking them out for more room. I have my little dresser here. This is for, you know, uh, sports bras, underwear, you know, uh, socks and um, shorts and everything there. This is my actually my dresser. So I have my sweatshirts and long shirts, sweaters um, and my pants and sweatpants and tights. You have a lot of room in here, and you got your hang, your clothes, your oh, you got those a, are my uniforms. You have a closet. Yeah, I basically do. So this, you know, it's a laundry, uh, not a laundry bar, but you know, it's specifically made for a car. So you see the hook that it has on it. So this is where it. I hang my uniforms, and then you know the other stuff that I need to hang. That's cool. And I got storage underneath because it's high up off the ground. I got my back of oh, my gym bag. Uh, and then I got all stored in there. So it, see, it's pretty high. So a lot of storage underneath and I can get from both sides. My little, my little led light candles. Oh. Yeah, they're cool. Those are so cute. I know. They I have know. a little flicker on the inside. And they really, no. Well, yeah, that, oh, but, they but it does. They have like a little light. Yeah. That is so cute. And they light up a lot. Trust me. I mean, it's like boom. And then, of course, I got my little lanterns, too. I got my lanterns there. My WeatherTech window coverings. Now, I splurged on these, you know, because originally I did get the um, Reflectix from uh, Home Depot, and I cut out my own, and I did that for about the first five months. But um, And I sprayed paint one side black, you know, and the other, kept the other side silver. But it really got, you know, they chipped and they worn down and everything. So I went on to uh, WeatherTech, and you can actually order it for your specific vehicle. So I got all the windows, every window I got a covering for. And like I said, you know, I did splurge. It was like about 300 bucks for all, but they're going to last me forever, you know. Does and, it also include the windshield? Yeah, everything includes every every single window. Even look at, they even have the little the little window here. Yeah, That's it's so, so cool. I know. So it has every it covers every window. So I'm literally in a cave. So that that also helps with keeping the heat out as well. Keeping the heat out and also keeping the heat in. Yes. You know what I mean? Because when I put it like on days like this, you know, or whatever. Um, if I put the black on the outside, if there's any sort of sun or any heat, it'll you know you know, black attracts the heat. And then again, yeah, it keeps it cool. 
on the silver side. Awesome. And do you have a, a curtain that separates the driving area from the... I do. It, and it basically, uh, well, you see, I have my curtain rod. It's just a $4 curtain rod, you know, from Walmart. And then I have, excuse me. Oh, mm -hmm. where did I put it? Oh, I got it. Right. Yeah, I moved it today. I put it underneath my candles. So I just fold it. Like that. And oh, I just okay. fold it on top. Just tuck it over. Yep. That's smart. I know. Right? Yeah. I love that. Listen, you know, you change. You know what I mean? Because you learn as you go, right? What you need, what you don't need, what works, what doesn't work. So I learned that it's just easier to fold it over instead of like actually putting it inside the rod. I try to make it homey, you know? It's so cute. Yeah. I got this one and then I got this one and then my green one or, or blue one. This one actually was a covering for a, uh, a weighted blanket before. So. so that keeps you warm and when oh. it's cold out. Yeah, are you kidding me? I sleep with shorts and a t-shirt on, even in 45 degree weather. Yeah, and I have no heater. You know what I mean? So no so, additional heater. No. Just, Except, just the blankets. Yeah. It's a little chilly in the morning though. You know, yeah. we know how that rolls. I got my socks. I got my hat. You know, that I put on in the morning. Well, I have my USB fan there. And then, you know, I usually just open up my windows. I got, I want to get another USB fan though. Um, I think I'm going to need another one. Although I did come to California when it was a hundred degrees when we had that, uh, yeah, heat wave or whatever. And, um, I was fine. I had that one fan and I just kept my windows open. I got the rain, the rain, um, things. Oh, the now. Rain guards. Yeah. The rain guard. So I can keep my windows open and, and nobody can, you know, tell and stuff. But obviously in the summer, the weather. I'll keep them down more. Oh, and then let me show you. Okay. I got my little kitchen here. I got my little camping stove that my mom sent me. Oh I know gosh. with a little, um, sterno right and then yeah i just bought this my little kettle the other day at walmart because i was using my little cup here i got a, a tin cup i use that and then uh, that's for my coffee and everything my food i usually just buy as needed you know but i do have my um lunch bag that i take with me on my trips for a flight attendant so oh, i keep yeah. all of my you know, snacks and everything in there. It's really good. I got this at Walmart. I got my hummus and, you know. You know, got to see the snacks. Yeah. I know. Sorry. It's my favorite. Yeah. Oh, chocolate chip cookies. So I got those. This is just for the snack snack. For dinner and stuff, I have my Hot Logic, which is, it's basically a hot plate. So... I just plug it into my power station, put my food in here, I cl close it up and it warms up food. So I get like the heat and eat uh, dinners and stuff that they have at the grocery stores and stuff. Like last night I had um, shrimp with cheesy cauliflower. That sounds yeah, delicious. Yeah, it was freaking good. <laughs> what is your favorite travel snack? Travel snack, oh my More God. Snacks. I would have to say I usually do potato chips. Okay, and I usually get the snacks off of the plane <laughs> if we have leftover snacks or Chex Mix, you know, at night when I'm watching my movies or, or watching whatever. Yeah, I would have to say I'm, I'm a salty, I'm a salty snacker. Yeah, every once in a while I'll throw in something sweet, but basically I'm a salty snacker. And then I have all my uh, toiletries here and everything for at night, you know, brush my teeth and, you know, of course, you know, our, our body wipes or whatever. And makeup removers and yeah and do you have any uh, water or sink or anything I do not I don't need it I just use bottled water you know I'm okay I go to the gyms I have that active fit do you, you know what that active and fit for no. $25 a month you can join like there's like 11,000 gyms throughout the United States I belong to 12 gyms in in California right now yeah I belong to uh, EOS choose planet fitness LA Fitness, 24-hour fitness. Yeah. Actually, 28. Sorry, $28 a month. That's a steal. Yeah, it is. And the Planet Fitness, too, you get the black card. Ooh. So I go sit in the massage chairs, too. That's I would like to say that I work out, but, uh, you know. 
And how do you power, like, you, do you have, like, a laptop or phone or stuff like that? I do have a laptop, and then this is my power station that I have. This is my EcoFlow. It's a 600 watt. So right now I'm at 71%. Um, I charge everything on this. And then I charge the actual battery when I'm driving. I plug it into my car, and it charges it up. So every time I drive back to the airport, you know, which I usually take the back roads, I take the scenic route, you know, to go down by the beaches. Um, it takes me about an hour to an hour 20, it'll charge up full. And then usually it takes me like maybe three or four days to even run it down. I love this thing. I thought about getting a bigger one, but right now for my needs, I don't really need it. You know, I'll wait until, you know, if I get a bigger van and I need, you know, I want to get a microwave like you have, you know, a <laughs> microwave and a fridge and all that stuff. But right now, I love my cozy Thelma. She's a good girl. Aww. She's a good girl. I actually have a little porta potty that folds and I keep it under here. So obviously this is the lid. And then whoop, it folds like that. And then I put um, a garbage bag, you know, and I usually use like a uh, cat litter. You know, something like that, you know, for, you know, pee. And then this is my seat. And then boom. How cute is That's that? That's it. I know. It's awesome. That is I know, really right? clever and portable. It is. For Folds up really nice, too. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, see? And it's quick. That's it. And then I just store it underneath here. Boop. It is very cozy and it's very roomy. I mean, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, so I sit here in the morning and I make my coffee. You know, and uh, yeah, it's like really roomy. And then when I do Instacart, obviously I have enough room to put all the, oh, the yeah. groceries and everything. And you know, of course I want to, you know, have my van look nice and stuff, you know. This is set up so nicely. I love her. I really do. She's, she's a great van. I've had her for, I bought her in 2018 and um, she's a champ. You know, she's a champ. She runs like a champ. Thank you again, Kathy, for Oops. showing us. <laughs> Oh my god, that was so funny. Was like, Whoa! This will be Sorry about the bloopers. <laughs> Take two. <laughs> okay, yeah. Thank you, Kathy, for showing us your home. It's a super awesome, great looking van, Thelma, the van. And uh, I appreciate you just showing us and letting us take part in your little, in your home on wheels. Thank you so much for um, letting me, I guess. And thank you so much uh, to all your fans and, and all the people out there um, for allowing me or letting me show you uh, my happy home. My Thelma. Yes. Yes. All right. Have a great day. Stay blessed. Yeah, bye. you too, sister. Bye. Bye. -bye. <laughs>